everybody, Dragal here, and welcome to episode one of my Nuts and Bolts Torqued series here on the FTOG server. This is a expert mode mod pack that is very similar to Infinity Expert Mode. I mean, you can't really say it's similar because, you know, the recipes are different, but it has a lot of magic mods and it has a lot of tech mods and they're all intertwined somehow, okay? So that is how, I guess, how it's similar to Infinity Expert Mode. And in episode zero, the prologue, I showed you guys uh, the base here. I gave you the tour um, after I built everything and just the basic um, rock hounding machines that we have set up. And also the bakery, we played around a little bit with cooking for blockheads. And between episodes, I did a lot of farming for wood and, um, you know, materials overall. I also explored the nether a little bit. I found a fortress close by, got three blaze rods. And then found out that I can't even make a brewing stand yet because that recipe requires coke, uh, coke oven blocks and so on. So we'll see what all the things that we're going to make today. But I do have a plan. I did plant these rubber trees here because we need to get started with IC2. I looked through a lot of the recipes, okay? I wanted to get into roots, botania, astro sorcery, and blood magic. No, I don't think we have blood magic. Do we have blood magic? We do have blood magic as well. What's the other one? Botania. Um, and I noticed that for a lot of these things, we're going to have to get two things. We're going to have to get a smeltery, and we're also going to have to get IC2 going. We just need it. IC2 is going to save us a lot of materials because the metal former makes you a plate out of one ingot. And with the forge hammer, as you guys know from the Age of Engineering a series, it takes two ingots per plate and so on. So it's, it's going it's to save us a lot of materials, right? Um, but before we can do that, even if you check the pattern right here, we gonna need to set up a coke oven because we need treated sticks, right? And paper instead of sticks and wood. So that's a big difference right here early on. Um, I did find a, I told you guys in the prologue, I found a immersive engineering building. I got 53 treated wood from that. So we can start that now, but I still want to set up the coke oven first, okay? And I did prepare a ton of things for that. We're going to need this, and we're also going to need the coal, I believe. And we're also going to get started on the quests, of course. I just checked if I was actually recording. Not that we're going to do quests here soon, and I forgot to hit record. Okay, so the Coke oven, I believe we're going to need to craft 14 times. Yes, let's, let's bring this up real quick. Coke brick. There it is, the thing right here. We need 27 of them, and you craft them in pairs of two, so we're going to craft this 14 times. So there's 40, uh, 56. We're going to need 56. So let's just make a stack and let's go ahead and make this here. Right there. So I need to craft this. Um, there's 22, 24, 26, 28. That's how much I need. And I'm going to have one left over and I'm going to craft two more. And I'll show you guys in a second why. I think that's the recipe, right? Yes, okay. I need these coke brick slabs as well because in order for you to make a brewing stand, you need three of those instead of the cobble. And where are we gonna put this coke oven? I think right here in front of the D3 right there. I think that'd be a good place for it. And I do have the, uh, whatchamacallit, engineering's hammer from one of the, from that village where I got the blocks for. Of course we could, actually, wait, hold on a second. Don't you need to right click the coke oven with an engineering hammer to form it? So how can you get make this if you can't make treated sticks yet? Maybe it forms automatically. Maybe I, I re, uh, remember that wrong. Let's just try it out. So I'm gonna need to go down two more so we can build this thing real quick. Hopefully people... Oh, one more thing I made, guys. It's really good to make early on is the sleep charm right there. Um, the recipe is just... You need to make sure you make a red bed with four leather and four sticks. And let me show you guys real quick what it does. It, I, I get rid of the animation. I just... Oh, you can only sleep at night. He must uh, have gotten the, the bed bug. That's why he logged out. But it you instantly sleep when you have this sleeping charm on you. So... I would definitely invest in that so you don't have that whole animation going on and so on. So what's going to happen here now? 
I don't understand. How can you make this if you... Let's check it out. If I come down here and I right click this with the engineering's hammer now. Let me try it with a fist first. No. Yeah, you need to right click this with the engineering's hammer. I am confused right now. How can you do this if you can't make crayo seed? I'm gonna have to check. Maybe there's a different recipe to make crayo seed. I have no idea. Let's check real quick. Um, recipe. Okay, recipe. Aha! So you can make crayo seed via seed oil. And four coal around it. Oh, okay. So that is actually what we should have done. That is the proper way then. If you don't find a village, you need to make the seat press. A, a squeezer. That's I think that's what it's called, right? The squeezer? Yeah, this thing right here from uh, forestry. We also need to get into forestry. And I'll explain that in a second why. So we got this thing going here now. And I'm going to take... I'm just going to put 20 coal in here for now. Actually, is there a recipe thing? That shows you all the items you can put in here to make Creo seed. Um, I want to check if there is maybe something else because it, it coal is so precious. Okay, so in the coke oven, coal. Ah, we can put wood to make charcoal. Oh, we're totally doing this, guys. I am saving my coal. Yes, I love it. We're going to use spruce because I farmed a bunch of that up earlier. Let's put this in here. Very good. I'm happy that I checked that before I'm wasting a bunch of the coal. Again, it's so precious, it's hard to get by. <laughs> At least in the beginning now. Okay, so now that we have this going, we're making um, creosite, which um, we're going to need soon to make treated sticks. So I'm going to make a bunch of these right here now. Let's just make this many. And I'm going to need to make some paper because I do want to set up the smeltery and then we're going to turn in some quests. I really would like to get some uh, different tools today. I'm tired of making stone tools. Um, what did I come over here for? Oh, man. Um, paper. Yes. So let's get... I think I should have... Yes. And we're going to get rid of three of those, right? So 60... 60... 60. All right, let's make a bunch of paper because I always out of it and this drawer was almost full right here. So now I can harvest it again. The only other plant I added earlier was hemp right here. I'm going to harvest this real quick because I barely have any because I made the slime sling. I found this uh, slime island over here right there and went up and got me uh, two slime saplings and also a bunch of the blocks, of course. And then I made the slime sling right here. Um, the hang glider I already had, and it required some hemp rope oils, which you just need the industrial hemp fiber. And then over here, I made this one right there, the green slime block with the three rubber. So now I got a slime sling. I can fly around a little bit easier and explore. So that's definitely useful. And let's put these seeds away. You guys also see it a little bit of cooking. It's kind of fun. I like this kitchen thing over here. It's It's... Like I mentioned in the prologue, uh, Spice of Life is really not causing me any trouble. You guys see, I've barely harvested. Um, I've been feeding these guys over there and car um, slaughtering them every once in a while for leather and so on. I, I don't need to close the door anymore, but it's just a habit. Um, so let's get rid of the here. And let's go ahead and make a bunch of patterns here. So let's say these four will need four. Actually, we need six. And then two, four, six, eight, ten. Let's just start with this many. I don't want to make too much that in case I don't need it right now. Um, I think that makes sense. Now, hopefully, I'm going to check the recipes real quick. Not that they're different. Stencil table is default. Where is the pattern? Why is there so many stencil tables? God. Art builder is default. Um, where's the tool station? Wait, where is the? The crafting. Station? What? <laughs> where's the tool station? 
to forge takes a tool station and I make you normal recipe. I wonder why it doesn't show up. And then of course we still need the storage, the pattern storage. Let's see. I guess I'll just search for pattern. That's going to be easier right there. Pattern chest. Okay. Sweet. So those are pretty much basic. I'm just going to need one log here. Give the spruce one. I don't really care what it looks like. All right. So let's go ahead and get the part builder. Let's get the stencil table and then we'll surround this. Actually, we're going to make two of these, one for the patterns and one for casts. And then we still need to make a tool station or oh, other way around or right there, right? This is all the ones and in order for these to all be connected, we also need a crafting station next to it. All right, so let's go ahead and set this up. Down here is where I want to put the smeltery. And I think it's going to be... Oh, this is going to be close. I don't have a lot of room here. I might put it down here, actually. Yeah, I'm going to put it right here. Let's go ahead and make a 3x3. Three three. Oh, this is where all my redstone is down there. Which I guess is fine. I mean, nothing is going to happen to the redstone of my piston door down here. Yeah, this is the T flip-flop. I don't, I, don't, I don't remember if I showed you guys how this worked. In the, I, I think I showed you the T flip-flop for a second. And because I want to make sure that I never lose anything, I'm going to get rid of my trash can over here. All right, did I get all three? There's two cactus. Where's the third one? Hmm, it might have... I don't know. Wait, was it only too tall? Oh, it was only too tall. Okay, never mind. All right, so we got this, and then I'm going to take, I think, for the time being at least, we're going to put... We're going to start from this end. We're going to put the stencil table, part builder... And then we're going to put this right there. The tool station. Really? <laughs> oh, you love it. love it. Okay, so now put it here. And then we'll put these two in between. The stupid flowers here. Get out of here. Flower. Put you there. I mean, I am trying to keep a few things here just because it's going to look nicer, right? Okay, so let's put this in here. And let me get rid of some of the stuff. Now, let's go ahead and make the patterns real quick. Just so we have them. Just trying to get a little bit... You also need to go over here. And we can close this hole real quick as well. And where am I going to put my trash can real quick? I do want to have one. Let's put it over here. Let's put the trash can right there. Go, let's put the second one on top. Good. All right. So. We're going to need a pickaxe. We're going to need the shovel. The axe, of course. I can't make any of these yet. I am going to make a broadsword this time around. And... I'm going to make these as well, just so we have them. And I think that's all we can make for right now. Oh, no, I need one more. This one, possibly. Yes, now we got all the ones that we need. All right, well, let's put them in here. And let's go ahead and make our smeltery components. To get this. I shouldn't need any more coal. And this I keep right now. That's fine. So um, the other thing is, I guess, let's let's go ahead and turn in a few quests here real quick. I said that we're going to do this real quick. Uh, of course, completed the grindstone here. We'll get some onion hamburgers. Delicious. Man, I haven't heard that noise in a long time. We haven't done any HQM in a long, long time. So let's put these in here. It's actually quite exciting. And it's not in a sky block, which is even better. This one here I completed. Um, we're going to get gold and iron. And I am going to take diamond. I don't have much use for emeralds right now. And I also have eight emeralds. So, 
can't complain about that, right? Put this away. And then why is this one here not completed yet? Oh, I still need to get a bucket of milk. Do I have a... Empty this one real quick and get a... Um, bucket of milk. We'll make sure I don't pour it over there. Alright, just put it here for a second. Excuse me? Are you completed? Manual detect. Okay. I get a liquid sunshine bucket. Um, or and a molten iron or bucket of blood. Let me sleep here real quick for the peeps. Yo, see how fast that was? How awesome is that? Put these away. And I don't really want the bucket of milk. I want Oh, I gotta drink it. Never mind. Okay, so now I can pick this up again. Um, and the other one is a bucket of blood or molten iron. I think I'm gonna take this bucket of blood because blood is harder to make. It takes all kinds of... So if we ever need blood, I have it. So I'm gonna take this one. And what else can we do here? Just keep on squeezing. Ah, I already got this one and I gotta make a squeezer. Which then we get a Pierce backpack and a scoop and some hives. Cool. I did collect a bunch of hives today. Rocky bees. Because in order to do this quest here, the CF powder, we need to make CF powder. And we need stone dust or small stone with it. And supposedly you get it from... Check here real quick. CF powder. You get this by cooking stone. But this recipe is broken. Um... When you cook it, you get some circuit boards or something. Uh, but the other way we can get it is by processing uh, rocky combs in a centrifuge. So that's why I want to make a centrifuge today. So we can start with the CF powder stuff for um, for IC2. I'm going to put these away in here for now. So they're just out of the inventory. All right, good. So and what else is there to do here? For now, I'd say nothing, okay? So for right now, we're gonna put this away again. We did two quests, that's awesome. But like I said, we're gonna go ahead and make some Tinker's Construct now. So Smeltery, I think, this way, yes. Now, the big difference right here is this um, recipe, yes. Because we need to make a seared furnace controller, which you need an iron furnace for, which requires five iron plates. I should have... Not here. Yes, I have another furnace right there. Let's go ahead and get started with these iron plates. I'm gonna need you. I don't think I need this guy. Um, I need to make another tool. Um, let me get this out from there and this here. Yes. All right, so let's go ahead and make five iron plates for the time being. There we go. What? What? It only takes one ingot? Wait a second. Is that for real? Well, that's... That is cool. Huh. That means the metal form is not that important right now. I mean, I would still like to do it, because then I need to make forge hammers. Oh, we got this guy, and then what does it take here? This is a block of coal coke. Oh boy. All right, so I'm going to need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And I need to switch this up here for the time being. Aha. Okay. Uh, but while I wait for this cold cook, what I can do here is let's let's make the other parts real quick. Um, I do want to have a regular tank. I need a controller. Oh, wait, that's not how you make the controller because we're in a different one. I'm gonna need a basin, a table, I'm gonna need two drains, and I'm gonna need two faucets. Okay, and then, like I said, for the controller, we just need to get this coal coke. And let's see here. Um, just gonna go ahead and let's build it. Didn't I have more in here? Yes, I do. Just gonna make right there let's go ahead and start with what we have because then uh, while i wait for the skull cook what i can do is go get some lava i have a spot in the mining dimension that i marked there's a big nice lava lake 
And we're gonna do it like this. And I think... Hello? Thank you. <laughs> I think I'm gonna make it too tall like I usually do. Even though then I'm blocking this. Hmm. Yeah, but otherwise it's gonna be a pain in the butt. Um, so be it. We'll block this off. I'm gonna put the tank probably over here on this spot. So we can close this off. Got three left. Perfect. Let's put two drains. One here, one there. And while the controller will be there, I can put it right now. This guy and then the two faucets. Kind of awkward having that next to the door. But I guess it's okay. We got a small little base. We're going to have to do with the room we have. It, it, I guess it fits right here. But let's check real quick. F7. Okay, so I am going to have to put a light right there. I don't want to have any spawning locations on the inside. Or apparently here. Ah, because it probably blocks that torch or something like that. So that's fine. Okay, so, but for in order for me to get lava, we're going to make a different tank real quick. And for that, I'm going to need some iron bars. And I want to make the ender IO right here, the fluid tank. This holds 16 buckets. That's a lot of lava for us to have. And before I set out, I'm also going to take this one with me. That holds four buckets. So I'm going to fill both of these. Wait for the cold coke to finish. Those nine that we need. And then we finish our smeltery. While I'm waiting for this cold coke to finish, I came back with the lava and so on. And I also made another tank right here for creosite. Which right here, I just set it to pull out of the... Oven. Oh, it's done. Perfect. Um, I'm making some bronze here because I would like to make the centrifuge today as well. Um, because I'm going to, you know, get ready for this next quest with the, whatchamacallit, uh, the CF powder, yes. And I just learned, I did not know that, that while by default, this thing does not ore double. I put nine copper ore in it and I actually got, where is it, right there. 11 copper dust back so apparently you have a chance of getting extra okay so let's go ahead and make this i'm guessing it's this okay so here's our block of cold coke and then uh, what did it take again um meltery i think it was just uh seven of those okay go ahead and get seven more of them right there all right, cool. We got our smeltery controller. We're, we're, we're doing things. wonder if that was actually a quest for something. I wonder. Okay, we got this done. What am I missing over here? I got this done. Oh, so I just got to make the squeezer as well. So I'm guessing we're going to make the squeezer. Ah, I get it. Because they wanted you to make seed oil. So you can make your treated sticks in order to form the coke oven. Okay, that makes sense. So now we got the smeltery, and I'm going to smelt up... Um, oh, that's fast. Uh, this is 16 gold blocks, because I think that every one of these I already made them is going to take two gold. I have found maybe four bauxite or something so far. I think very little. Let me see if I can find it here real quick. Uh, there it is. Six. Six bauxite. So... Um, I cannot make the aluminum brass, so we're gonna just have to use gold for... And look how much gold I have, by the way. Hey. Um, right there. I have almost two stacks of gold left. This is bananas, okay? <laughs> I cannot complain. Okay, so when these are done, I'm gonna go ahead and make the cast. This is one block and seven ingots. Get it 16. And I think each one of them, let's just make one together real quick. Um, one block five. So it takes two ingots per cast. Okay. But I don't want to make these on camera. I'm going to make all those real quick and then figure out what two material I want to use as well. But I think we're going to do the other thing together here real quick. And that is... Oh, so that means I'm going to need more bronze real quick. Let's go at... No, actually, let's go squeezer and centrifuge. Like this. Okay, so this one is going to take a sturdy casing, and this is going to take a sturdy casing. 
which each one of them is bronze. This is tin upper. So that would be 4 8. This is more materials you need for this. Much more. Um, okay, so we're gonna do it this way. And for the. What are you? How do I make you? It's uh, silicon and redstone. Is there a way to do it in here? Melting. No. Okay. So we're gonna have to do it this way, which means I need a tin gear, which is tin around a basic gear with just tons and tons of redstone and then bronze plates. But I'm gonna need 16 bronze plates. I only have 12. Um, let's get a little bit more cooked up here. So I'm gonna need copper and tin. So now my question is, if this doesn't double it, I can just put it in the smeltery, right? I mean, there's no reason for me. I don't want to mix up too much stuff. Gold should not mix with any of it. So let's go ahead and smelt that in here. So we're going to make the ingot cast real quick first. So we have that. So I'm going to need. So that's going to let's just make five because I think we're going to need a lot of. Actually, that's going to be one, two, three, five that way. Yes. Let's put this in here, and I'm going to need to put these two extra in a second. So that's how I'm going to make... I, I don't want to process too much stuff, guys, because I would like to, you know, or double this as soon as we have IC2, the macerator, I think. Wait a second. Yeah. Oh, the tin smelt so fast. That's why I can put it in. Yes. Okay, so... This is going to make us all the bronze that we need. And I need... Four more right now. So let's get this down to the bottom. Just uh, make four more. I only want to make this real quick with you guys. Um, give it to me. Ooh, this hardens fast. I like it. So this is different looking bronze, which doesn't really matter. Um, and I do have a a drawer in there that I've used um, before. <clears throat> excuse me. To unify the copper and so on that I already had from dungeon chests right here. So if I put this one here for example and then you guys see if i just right click it puts it all in here and i have 16. okay so now let's see if this is also just one for one yes okay so i got 16 of these and then what is this around around this stuff here okay so i'm gonna need i do have tons of redstone so that is no problem at all so we're just gonna make 32 redstone torches here right now that is one thing I have a lot of. You guys see here, I have over a stack of blocks. <laughs> Ooh, I already had 14 torches. Ah, well, they're not going bad. All right, so this thing right here, I'm going to need some tin. Did I cook up any tin? Yes, I do. Let's get this out. And how do you make this gear in here? This is cobblestone. I have that as well. Let's go ahead and make of these actually this is a pretty cool button here i like this button and there's two in um then you and one more time all right very nice and i should ha does it need to be no it, it can be any stained glass plus 10 i need 12 12 10 i have enough uh, where's my glass? I think it's in here. Yep. Oh, wait. I have to make those first. Uh, yes. Right there. And very cool. Um, I don't have any power yet, so I'm, I'm going to show you guys in a minute how I'm going to handle this. And you. So here's our squeezer. And we're going to make our centrifuge as well. Very good. Yay. I'm going to use this puppy right here. That scared me here for a second. Um, and we are going to put... Let's let's get rid of these two here for a second. And we're going to put them down right there. So this is my squeezer. Which I don't need now. But that what we would have used to make the cryo seat. But we're going to put this guy up here. And I kept, didn't get these combs right there. I have seven. You guys see I have a bunch of rocky beasts, which I am actually going to set up with you guys right now. I need two drones and one more princess. 
Uh, let's set up those right now. We're gonna put those, they need sky access. So I think for the time being, we're gonna put them right here. Right, you, you have sky access right there and there. And this cobblestone back here should be close enough for them to have their food. They, they need to have smooth stone or cobblestone, I think, one of those two. All right. And we see the bees coming and the bees coming. So they're going to make me more combs. Because the CF powder, if we need a lot of it, I don't know. Let's put this in here and get it going. And when it's red, we can step away. Bam. All right, good. So it's going to do its thing here now. I, I have no idea how long this takes and so on. Put this away. Don't need these anymore. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and make all the rest of these casts and wait out that... Well, that scared me for a second. I thought there was cobblestone on the wall, but it's the draconic way. And I'm gonna make the rest of these casts, like I said, and get some materials together for our tools the way I want them. So I made the materials in your book right here and I looked through the materials, the different ones. And I think this time I'm going to use bronze for the heads. I've not used that before, but if you compare it to like iron, iron has a durability of 204, mining speed 6, mining level diamond. And the other ones here are a little bit out of reach right now. Copper is much less and bronze is 430, mining speed 6.8. Also diamond level um, mining. And it seems to be a good head for the pick and all the ones, okay? Let's see here. Attack 3.5. How much does iron have? Attack 4. But it has a lot less durability. Hmm. That is... Hmm. How am I going to do that? Should I go... I think for the sword, we're going to go with iron. Let, let's do that, because I'd rather have the half extra base damage, and it's just going to be... I, yeah, it should only be one I need for the sword blade, so let's get this going as well. All right, so let's get the, the bronze down here. That's here already. So we're going to pour those real quick, each one of them. And then I also need to find out if I can make mending mode, okay? So for the time being, I'm just, whoops, I'm going to hang these over here, just so I have a little less stuff in my inventory. Okay, so we're going to have this right there, then the toolbar is going to, the whatever the thing is called, the, the tool binding maybe, I think it's called. I still have enough bronze, yes, plenty. Okay, let's get the axe out of bronze, and then we're going to bring the iron down for the sword this guy right there okay and we're gonna use this in a second yes that is oh it takes two apparently okay get another one oh, i can oh i can make the other thing here let me sleep quick I put my bed outside because I didn't want to go up into this uh, into the attic every time I want to sleep. So I figured I'm going to put this outside there. Okay, so let's do this. And let's make the thingamajig here. The tool binding I want to make out of paper. So we get an extra modifier. I'm going to leave this now. And now I got to wait for this iron. Yes, and then we're going to make these two still. Because I'm going to make a obsidian sharpening stone to upgrade the pickaxe. So I get to, um, I think, Ardite uh, uh, leveling. You know what? While we wait for this iron, let's go ahead and make this bookcase. Now, the bookcase, the regular one here, requires living wood planks. But the spruce one takes spruce wood planks. Now, I'm pretty sure that I won't be able to make mending moss with this one. But I want to give it a try. Maybe it has been updated in recent uh, patches or something, Tinkers. Um, that it might work now. And I got 22. Just make fresh ones. It doesn't matter. Right there. Get all of these. And I'm going to need four. Four. 
right so let's see if i right click this get one at a time no it does not work okay but what i'm gonna do is i'm going to find a village that has oak bookshelves in it and then once i find it i'm gonna tune in because i do want to put the mending moss on here that's it's really important to me i think so here's the other iron let's do that and I'm just nowhere near. Uh, Botania, for example, the, um, there's no flowers that get generated. You need to make that um, that floral powder, right? And then you need to grow your own plants. And all the two rods, all four of them, I'm going to make out of copper. Oh, that means I'm probably going to need... Oh, it only took one ingot. Okay. See the cactus popping off over there. Because that's actually half a material, the, the two rods. So that's fine. So that worked out. And when it comes to the other enchants, we're going to figure that out when, when the series goes on a little bit. I don't want to spend any time on that today. All right, so let's get rid of this one as well and bring the obsidian down. And we're going to make that sharpening stone. Should fill it. Yes, it does. Okay. Very good. But we're getting we're getting there. We got the, the bees going as well. I gotta right click that real quick. Or forget. Da -da -da. Let's make it red and then we can walk away again. You know it's actually not too bad this clockwork engine. I mean yeah, it's not fast or anything, but it's free and we already have four of these stone dust, so we can turn this quest in later. Alright, let's assemble our tools. Let's start with the pick. All right, so we got our bronze pick. Then, oh, I forgot that each one of these needs a binding now as well. But perfect, you know, I have it sitting right there. And I wanted to make the other binding out of, can I get it? Thank you. I wanted to make out of cactus to get the bleeding effect. Or should I make it out of, should I make it out of paper so I get the extra modifier on the sword? I'm not sure yet. Let's let's make these first. So you, you, and you. The shovel, axe, and then last but not least, I need to make this puppy. And right here, this is my thing now. Do I want to make this out of paper or a cactus? Well, you know what? Let's just go ahead and make one paper, and let's make one cactus and compare those two real quick. Keep this. So this is attack 6, modifier 3. And spiky, 200% cooler with spikes. Blocking deals damage to the attacker. Aha, that's not actually what I want. And yeah, we're going to go with the paper. Definitely, because I never wore a shield. And how do I block with a sword? You can't really, okay? All right, so let's go ahead and get these tools on the bar. And oh, one more thing. I need to still put it's in here on the pickaxe put our obsidian sharpening stone with a flint and now we're getting where does it tell us the mining level cobalt look at that and the wait we have x wait do we have inkers tool leveling why does it show xp Oh, oh, if you don't have mending moss on there, I'm not sure. Where does it show me? The durability is right there. It doesn't actually go up the durability. Okay, with the sharpening stone. So eventually we probably want to um, switch out the head right there. Okay, and I'm going to set out now. I think we have everything done here, right? Yes. I'm going to go ahead and set out now to one of the villages that I have marked on my map. And when I am there, we're going to make our mending moss. And I'm going to leave these old two. Right in here. This, I don't need it. And I'll see you guys over there in just a minute. All right, I found the village. Now we can only hope that I find one of the buildings with the bookshelves in it. And I don't know. I might take the crates, but the rest of them will leave. I don't think anybody's going to come over here because I flew across the ocean, actually. Right down here. And you guys see I was going so fast. That the map couldn't even keep up. And luckily I got really low over here. I found the mainland. 
Ow, what? So many things hurting you in this game. Poison ivy, cactus. Right, no. What do you have for trade here? Anything good? Uh, nothing special. All right, let's focus. I want just. I just want to find bookshelves right here. Right here. Yes. Oh yeah. Excuse me, sir. May I? May I use your bookshelves, please? All right. Let's see if we can get this going. I think it takes ten levels, right? Bam! Got one. So that's gonna go on the pick. Bam to that's all I can get for now, but I'm gonna bookmark this here guys and then once I have uh, I'm back at 20 levels. I'm gonna come back over here and um, Get the other two mending moss, but I'm gonna go ahead and Let's just check here real quick. What's, this is the building we checked. Is there anything else cool here? I'm gonna say no Look like it no blacksmith and you know what? I'm not even going to worry about this other immersive engineering building. If somebody finds it, good for them so they get free goodies. We're making Creosid now, so I really don't need to make the... Whatchamacallit? The, I, don't, I don't really need to take the crates, but we're going to check this out here. I'm not going to use this right now. I want to show you this here. Right, none here. And I always put these blocks back because I don't want them. Right, is it here? Nope. In case you have never seen it. There's a lot of these around, so a lot of free loot in the area. Or in the world, I should say. And of course, it's got to be at the last one. Because I'm recording, you know. So I am going to use the shovel. Now I'm going to just give this the mending moss first. What? There was no crate? No chest in either one of them. Interesting. Well, I'm going to go head home and... Well, actually, I don't need to. I'll just keep recording now that we're in safety. Let's go ahead and sleep real quick. We get two mending mosses. And like I said, it was just a short flight over the ocean. I can get the other two. Come on, peeps. Sleep with me. Thank you. Thank you, Fuzzy. And we're going to go ahead and enchant this one. With one mending moss for now. And you see it says stored XP. And it shows XP, 4 or 500. Oh, I can't wait to see if there is maybe some kind of a leveling thing going on here. And there's a fourth one. So I just need these two. I'm going to keep these two on me. Till the time that I have the XP, which shouldn't be hard to get. Um, And what is the other thing? Yes, I do want to look at this CF powder stuff real quick. Um, Well, actually, let's turn in the quests first. Let's do this together, because we got this one right now that we have the squeezer. There is a tropical, a modest, a meadows, and a forest. We got four meadows, and I'm going to take the forest one. It doesn't really matter. You can get all of these very easily, so I don't know. <laughs> it doesn't really matter, and I'm going to put this in here. I have a bunch of stuff. Okay, and then the next quest was the hammering it out, which we're getting a redstone gear, and I do not care about any of them. I have them all. All right, and the coke oven, we get 16 full coke. All right, what's next here? Blast furnace. Okay, so we're probably going to get started on that next time, but I do want to make the CF powder real quick, if you guys don't mind. Um, let me just toss it, and I clean it up later. Even this book and the apiary is back back. Okay. So oh, CF powder, let's take a look at this real quick because we also need to make the CF sprayer which is three iron item casings and four tin and a glass pane. Okay, so let's do this here real quick. Let's get iron and tin and then I'll need one glass pane. I need my forge hammer and I think that we can double hammer it. People told me that earlier that apparently that's possible. So sorry, what did I say again? I need three iron. Three, two, three, and two, four, six. Okay, so you double it. Let's just make this many. Let's go ahead and make this thing and make this. So we got the CF sprayer. And then this one here takes sand, clay, and the stone. 
And this is something that I have not done before. I did not know. Um, I think Smash told me that. Yes. Oh, I need one more. I am one short. Are you kidding me? Did you guys make me a comb? Please, please, please tell me you made me a comb. No? No! <laughs> All right, guys. I'm going to say that we're going to finish that next time then. But as far as Smash told me is that you can make simply a water hole. Let's say we'll put it right here. And we put water in it. And then when you right click it with that CF foam, it turns it into usage. F powder. Hello? Why is there no usage? Oh, it says it right here. Right click water to create construction foam fluid. And then when you right click it, I think with that sprayer, it sucks that up. Okay, so we're going to do that next time. But. I gotta wait for more combs or go to the mining agent and so on. And I hope you enjoyed the episode. We got a lot done today. Um, we're, we're doing good. We didn't get into IC2, but um, we're gonna tackle that next time. Hopefully, we'll get it with the blast furnace and so on. And all tips and tricks are appreciated. If you wanna write them down in the comments, you know, if you're playing this pack yourself, bring it on. I always learn a lot of things from you, and I hope you guys learn something from me as well. And until next time, take care, stay safe, and bye-bye.